Hey guys, welcome to my channel and welcome to the first video or the first day of Vlogmas. Yes, I know it's not really Christmassy right now in this room I am in, <laughs> which is the bathroom, but that's okay. <laughs> In this first video of Vlogmas, I want to go ahead and introduce myself, tell you a little bit about myself, and also tell you guys how my Christmas was as a child, my childhood Christmas. So, if you're new here, which I'm pretty sure most of you are, if you're not, then hi <laughs> again. But anyways, if you're new here, hi, my name is Cynthia. I make parenthood, lifestyle, and toddler videos. I am 27 years old. My zodiac sign is a Taurus, um, which means my birthday is in April. I will be 28 next year in April. I have a one-year-old daughter named Adeline. She will be 18 months exactly, or 18 months on Christmas. So right now she's 17-ish months, almost 17 months. Or no, she is 17 months. She's going to be 18 months um, on the 16th. Wow. <laughs> We're already December 1st. That's crazy. Of course, obviously, um, first day of Vlogmas, of course it's December 1st. I just, I guess it hasn't gotten to my head yet. Um, I have a boyfriend. His name is John. And we've been together for five and a half years. So that has been fun. <laughs> Um, what else? I am a new mom. My daughter is my first child. Um, so I'm learning about being a parent, figuring things out. And I have been on YouTube for about a year now. I'm really excited to do Vlogmas. I've watched a lot of Vlogmas um, videos a while back and before. And I've always wanted to do it, like it seemed like a real challenge to be able to post a video every single day. And it's just really exciting. Um, I'm going to be going from a video once a month to a video every day, so I'm ready for the challenge, definitely. Um, my Vlogmas vlogs aren't going to be traditionally Vlogmas, basically, because they're not all going to be... Um, based on Christmas because I'm not I love Christmas I love Christmas music I love the spirit of Christmas but I'm not really a big um, celebration of Christmas person I guess you can say um, so I don't really have any decorating much to do other than to hang one stocking which belongs to my daughter <laughs> that's pretty much it so pretty boring <laughs> around the holidays but um, I want to use this time, this Vlogmas time, to have you guys get to know me since I have been on here a year, haven't really talked much about myself, and I want you guys to get to know me um, and my little family. And also throw a little some facts out there that I have learned through um, being a parent, and um, I, of course I will throw some um, Christmas themed stuff out there as well. Um, I do have a video coming one of these days. <laughs> is um, what I got Adeline for Christmas this year, maybe some Christmas ideas on another video. I also want to show you guys how I organize stuff. Um, I do love to organize, but it doesn't always stay organized. Of course, with the one-year-old, you can't expect it, but at least you can try it, right? There's those. So, And there's other videos that I want to talk about as well. Um, one video you guys might be looking forward to is um, the fact that Adeline isn't going to believe in Santa Claus. Like, I'm not going to pursue that, lot, you know, journey for her. So that might be interesting for you guys to watch. I know I'm probably going to get a lot of comments about, like, ruining her childhood and stuff like that by not believing in Santa Claus. But um, we'll see um, <laughs> how that one does. Um, yeah, so... What else? I have a dog. His name is Simon. I've had him for four years now. I got him when me and my boyfriend were together for, I think, a year and a half, two years. So we've had him pretty long. All right. <laughs> That's a little bit about me. Um, let's answer the question of how was my Christmas growing up? 
Yes. <laughs> um, this is a little weird because I'm not used to talking about myself on videos too much. It's mostly about my daughter and like things I've learned, so um, bear with me. <laughs> and I'm trying not to edit these videos because if I have to take time to edit, then it's going to be even harder to post. So you're going to see like the raw footage. Like I'm not really going to edit any of these videos, maybe like one or two or whatever, depending on how long I pause because sometimes I pause for like a really long time and it's like, I gotta edit that out, you know? But anyways, um, Christmas as a kid was great. It wasn't like crazy. Um, I have a lot of siblings, but I only grew up with my sister and my cousin and we were raised by pretty much our grandmother. She did adopt me, so technically my mother. So, um, it was a small family, it was just us four. So Christmas holidays weren't really big. Um, she didn't really cook that much like she did on Thanksgiving. She mainly just made like a ham sometimes and then we just have like regular food um, on Christmas. The only thing special we did was like we would wake up and open our presents and then watch TV for the rest of the day. Um, as I, as we all got older, my cousin and my sister started doing their own thing for Christmas. Like, even in high school, they would go to, like, friends' houses or stuff like that. So it would just be me and my grandma. I would just open my presents and that would be it, <laughs> pretty much. It was, I want to I don't want to say a boring Christmas, but it wasn't really eventful. Um, a Christmas I can remember, I remember, like, maybe three Christmases. One Christmas I remember getting a doll from Santa. It was like a little baby doll. And I remember the package saying from Santa, but I knew it wasn't really from Santa. Like I believed in Santa, but I didn't. And I recently asked my grandma, hey, you know, did I believe in Santa? Because I honestly don't remember. And she's like, she never told me that he was real, but I guess from watching Santa like in the mall and like in the movies and stuff like that I guess I assumed he was real or something so I somewhat believed like I don't really remember really believing in him but I do remember always getting excited to see Santa although <laughs> I do remember no I don't remember I actually have a picture of me on Santa's lap crying and I think it was about five or six maybe between like four and six and that's the only picture I have with him, actually. So I don't even remember taking pictures with Santa at like seven or eight or anything like that. And I don't think I did, <laughs> honestly. So that's probably the reason behind of me not wanting to tell Adeline, but that's another video, so I'll explain that later. Um, so the second Christmas, I remember getting an Easy Bake Oven. I remember always wanting an Easy Bake Oven, and I got one for Christmas, and I used it all the time. And I remember my grandma not being too happy. I'm not sure if she got it or my mom got it. But I remember her being like the baking stuff exactly for that. Like the certain baking products is like hecka expensive. She hardly ever wanted to buy me those things. And I, I totally understood. But when she could, she did. I loved, I loved my easy bake oven. It was like amazing. <laughs> um, another Christmas... I remember, I remember my grandma getting me, I loved, um, I went through a Hello Kitty phase, I think around like 10 or something, 10, 11, and so she got me a towel set of, um, Hello Kitty, and I remember not really being too happy, but like me faking it because I didn't want to hurt her feelings, because in my head I was like, oh, that's great, it's Hello Kitty and I like it, but it's towels. It's like getting socks for Christmas, it's like, mm. but I mean, I did like them, I just wasn't like super thrilled <laughs> to get towels for Christmas, but it was a thought that counts, of course, and I did like them, so. Um, another Christmas, I remember going Christmas shopping with my grandma every year, and I remember one year, she would ask me what I wanted. So, like, I had an idea every year of what I was going to get. And I remember asking for a, a live doll. Like, those little a live dolls that pee and stuff like that. And, like, you can feed them and they pee and all that. 
And I remember getting it, I think, for Christmas, yes. So, like, I think that's one reason I didn't really believe in Santa, because it's like, well, my grandma's like, hey, you know, what do you want for Christmas? Okay, and then I get it. It's like, not only that, I went Christmas shopping with her. And so, like, of course, like, the kids who do believe in Santa, like, they still say, you know, you get one present from Santa and you get the rest from our parent, your parents, you know, me and mommy and daddy. So, I mean, I don't know. I just, I'm trying to think, like, if I ever believed in Santa, like, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe I'll put that towards the other video. But yes, Christmases at my house were pretty boring, but pretty great because, of course, you know, time with family. And I got to open presents. I loved to putting up the Christmas tree. That was one of my favorite things. We would usually put it up maybe a little bit after Thanksgiving. So like around the first, like around now, we would put up the tree. And I just loved um, going through all the stuff and putting up the tree. Um, I have, I think, two or three ornaments that I made as a kid. I made like one ornament, it was a glass bowl. And then I made, I want to say like a, macaroni picture frame of me I think in third grade or something or it was second grade I don't remember and then I made another ornament or like a little gingerbread paper thing when I was like 19 or something or 18 when I was in um when I had my first job I made it there um so yeah I like looking at like the stuff that we made and stuff like that and putting up the tree Currently, those ornaments are still at my grandma's, and once I get my own place and have my own tree, then I would definitely bring those ornaments that I made to my house, and yeah. And I want Adeline to start making ornaments too. Like, every Christmas, I want something from that year. So, like, I still have to think of what I want to do this year, even though we don't have a tree, I still want to make an ornament for her or get one. Um, so either I'll go to the dollar store and get those ornaments that are like clear and then I can make something for her or um, I was thinking about just having a picture of her and like putting it in the ornament and that can be like one for this year or something like that. So I definitely want that to be a tradition. I want every Christmas to have a different ornament for her so that like as she grows up, she'd be like, oh, this is my first Christmas ornament. This is, you know, my second Christmas, you know, stuff like that. So, um, I might even do a DIY on how to put a picture in a, um, ornament ball thing. <laughs> so, stay tuned for that. Um, other than that, I really have nothing else to say. Because <laughs> if I say everything now, then I won't have any other video ideas for later. So, thank you for watching this. Thank you for watching for my first vlogmas um i'm really excited to do vlogmas this year and i'm really hoping and i'm hopeful and i'm i think i'm pretty good at like doing it every day especially since i'm not really gonna edit my videos that much so yeah <laughs> thank you for watching if you have not yet subscribed please do hit the notification bell when you subscribe so you never miss a video because I'll be I'm gonna be you know throwing these videos out every single day I'm gonna do it I'm ready for the challenge vlogmas 2019 it's here and it's gonna be a great one so thank you for watching I hope you guys I hope to see you guys in my next video bye